Don't know if you guys can see, but it's snowing. It's May. What is happening? What is going on? What a weird thing to wake up to. Matthew just woke me up, so I'm a little bit delirious, to be honest with you. Hey, puppy, do you want to go outside into the snow? I mean, it's not a lot of snow. It's just snowing. Is that a tail wag? Oh, sorry, buddy. You're stuck in here. Oh, oh. It was snowing this morning, and now there's like hardly a cloud in the sky. We're going into week seven. Um, we're doing a deload week. I talked about it in the deload deadlift video that this is the time I kind of start getting a little demotivated and I kind of stop going in the gym and stop, you know. Keep on keeping on and all that jazz. Um, so that's why I'm hoping that the deload week will kind of, you know, I'll go into the gym next week and I'll be hopefully a little bit stronger when I retest everything except my bench. Um, and it kind of keep me motivated during like the deload week and um, I'm doing like 50% of everything. So like I go in and do lap pull downs at like 100 pounds, it's an easy weight, but I'm doing nice and controlled. You know, I'm doing like 15 pound dumbbell press, like I'm doing easy weight for more reps, more sets, and yeah, just hoping that that'll get me back into the rhythm of the gym. Also with that, what we're gonna start doing is, because I've basically been maintaining my weight and I kind of, I still want, I've lost eight pounds and I still wanna lose a little bit more. Um, I'm gonna take my macros, I'm gonna take a basic approach to my food and to my macros where I'm basically gonna eat a protein sauce, which is mainly gonna be chicken, um, veg, salad, and just a, a small amount of carbs. So I'm currently at, <laughs> I'm currently at um, 108 grams of carbs a day. I'm gonna take that down to maybe 120. Um, my fats are at 54. I'm gonna take that down to 40. Uh, my protein's gonna stay the same. I haven't really been hitting my protein, so we'll be introducing protein shakes back in to my diet. I'm gonna take a very simple like approach to my food, um, basically starting today. So egg whites for breakfast. And then, which is why I bought the pre-made salad mixes, just because it's easier for me to like, it, it, when we have those in the fridge, I find it easier to eat a salad than like big iceberg lettuce, because you gotta like get the chopping board out and cut everything up. Whew, gym done. 22 minutes of cardio done, I'm sweating. I haven't sweated on the bike for a while. Um, I got about 20 more minutes left to do on the bike, so I reach an hour. I'm doing an idea of cow- uh, an idea- an hour- an hour- oh, I- Woo! Can't speak! I'm doing an hour of cardio this week while it's my Devo- de Wow! Wow! Take three. Doing an hour of cardio this week while it's my deload week. Uh, so yeah, I'm gonna have some food. Probably do another 20 minutes when I get home from work just because it's like two o'clock. I gotta eat, shower, get ready for work and stuff like that. So, um, I'm gonna have some beef mints. I'm gonna have salad. And that is it. And some vinaigrette. For dinner, it's got salad, some vinaigrette, some beef mince, mango curry sauce. Perfection. Morning there, folks. I was supposed to be up at five with Matt. So you go with Matt to film for the Field of Dreams because they 
exceeding the field of dreams today. But when I woke up at five, Matt was still asleep, so I rolled back over. And it's now currently six o'clock. So they're actually seeding at half six, so I'm taking him to see if he still wants me to go, because I'm up. I'm up now. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna make a little coffee. I'm even so awake, I've got washing on right now. That's how awake I am. Once I get up, I'm up. Plus, there's not a cloud in the sky, so I really don't want to be in the house right now. It's... Woo! Spilt everywhere. Coffee. Half milk, half water, two packs of coffee. Probably won't drink it all. But, just... Something hot. I probably definitely won't drink all of that. I'm on such a my dog at Tick Pill the other day. Diesel. Hey, buddy. You having fun? So sunny and so bright. It is currently eight o'clock. Jesus. Um, and the boys are seeding. So this is for the field of dreams. So this is for the end of July. So yeah, things are going okay. I got a couple of good shots. I'll probably get the drone out again a little, in a little bit. Um, I want to try and maybe get in the side by side as well and get some shots of it moving but we're only going to make like a couple probably a couple of minute long video um, like we did with the treating of seed which I will link in the description box below because it's on the Prairie Soils website um, YouTube channel so yeah and then I've just been fiddling around trying to make an intro for the Prairie Soils videos so that the people know that the videos were made by Prairie Soils and that it's I guess I should put, probably put something in it that I made it, because uh, the video was on Facebook. My phone is just covered in dog slather and dirt. God, that's disgusting. Um, so yeah, the video apparently was on Facebook. Um, so. so it downloads it, and now it's going to
Currently on my way home. Shut up, radio. Um, primarily because it's almost 10 o'clock. Need to go and give the dog his pills. Um, I'm gonna quickly try and grab my Canon battery for this camera because I don't know when the battery in this is gonna die because it doesn't tell me because it's a Wasabi battery and not a Canon. And then I'm also gonna try and charge the drone batteries while I'm at home because we're, on, we're down to one. <sighs> oh jeez. And then we'll head back. Um, and I'm already cooking up some ideas on how to make the video and when we actually do the Field of Dreams. What the hell was that? I got a couple couple of ideas going on in my in my brain home. Um, and then I'm gonna edit some videos when I get home. Um, I'm a little behind on the vlogs, which hasn't happened recently. I've always been kind of ahead. But yeah. Also, just look how stupid I look driving Matt's truck. I look like a child. I look like an eight-year-old driving a car. Ridiculous. steering wheel this is ridiculous big old truck yeah I know I'm sorry it was a quick visit but I'll be home soon don't look sad okay who's a good boy yeah you a good boy I got you buddy I know it was a short trip I love you bye buddy all right Let's go back to the farm. Alright. And just like that, day is done. Just gonna go drive around and see the guy's yard because apparently we're gonna build something similar in the yard. So let's go have a look. That is not right. It is not one degree. It can't be. It feels like 20 degrees right now. It's time. So we can't escape. I hope that works. This is the life. All right, I've just been doing a little bit of editing. Um, Bear's been throwing up. He threw up yesterday. He's been throwing up a little bit today. Doesn't really seem himself. Um, so I just found the vet. And was just like, should I up his? Prednisone, like, should I just give him an extra pill and just keep an eye on him? So, that's what we've done, but I'm just gonna take him in. Yeah, you don't really see him yourself. So I'm just gonna take him, we're gonna go for a bit of a car ride. As I was saying before, this camera rudely died, um, is I don't actually have any deodorant, so I've been using mats today, and I smell like a dude. So he's just not even getting up. The, I know the air bed's still up. Parker might stay. We don't really know. Come on. <whistles> We're going outside. All right. We just got home from the vets. He's okay. His numbers are low, but they're still on the safe side. Uh, basically, just up his pred. Um, up his Florida, 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 Florida. 
to he has five at the minute, so we're just opening it to six um, for like a day or two, literally. Um, and basically, no human food. Um, he's been eating chicken with his pills. The chicken might be off, might have been off. So we'll just have to keep an eye on him for a couple of days. He's had a little bit of a upset stomach, but I think you can tell. Holy! I sat outside for literally an hour, maybe, and the weather app said it was 12 degrees. It lied, it was 20. So if, had I known it was 20 degrees outside when I sat on the hammock, I would have put sun cream on, but my weather app told me it was 12. And because of the breeze, I guess I didn't really feel it. So it's May and I'm already sunburned. My good old ginger jeans, pasty white skin. Just a little on my shoulders and obviously on my chest, but damn. Oops. So pretty full on day. Um, today we got up at five-ish, uh, filmed with Prairie Soils, um, filming the seed and stuff. I say I got up at five-ish because I did actually wake up at five. Matt did leave before me, because um, I, I think I left the house around about quarter past six-ish. Um, yeah, sat outside for a little bit, got a little, little sun sunburn going on. The good thing about the sunburn is obviously I've just got to have a shower um, because I, I smelt like boy. Now I don't, thankfully, because <laughs> luckily I picked up some deodorant. Um, the sunburn doesn't hurt when I get in a warm shower, so it can't be that bad. And it just looks bad when you're in a dark corner, like natural lighting, you can't really tell. Ish, that looks bad though. Um, spoke to my family. I've edited a video, got a video uploading, we've been to the vets. Yeah, you're okay. You're okay? You're just a little sick? Got a little tummy issue? Why are you breathing like that? Why are you breathing like Vader? <laughs> I love the fact that when you get up at like 6 o'clock in the morning, it's like full on daylight outside. It doesn't get dark now till like nine-ish. Ah, oh, it's just so good. You put drill on the floor? Would you like another puppy? Would that help? Yeah, I guess. I got you, bro. I got you, bud. So guys, I will see you whenever we pick up this camera again and film a day. Say goodnight, bud.